another honorable has actually come out to spill bullshit complete bs honorable mojisola ali macaulay here is her instagram handle she came out and she spilled complete bullshit lovers welcome back to my channel if you're seeing my face for the first time you are welcome to my youtube channel please subscribe like and share our video here is where you get all the trending gists hot topics so come on in let us dissect let's analyze all right so another honorable has actually come out to display her foolishness and i am really upset with this lady because she claims in her speech she claims that she schooled in the uk really if you schooled in the uk and this is the best you can come up with then i guess the schools over there is just nonsense they didn't teach you anything because you just showed the whole nigerians how ignorant you are you're comparing the, the youths of the UK, how, how they don't, there, there's unemployment in the UK and, and they don't behave the way the youths of Nigerian behave. Really? You're going to compare the unemployment rates in the UK and that of Nigeria. Is it the same? Is it even close? Can you hear yourself talk? Talking about how social media is messing up things and you're afraid of giving your kids uh, um, phones. Where are you from? Le really, really? Who? I, I just don't understand. Who are the people that vote for people like this? Who? From the, from the first word that comes out of this honorable Mojisola... Uh, whatever her name is it's, it's just complete stupid like it doesn't make any sense the lady is not making sense at all and the fact that they all sit in that house of assembly in lagos and they they vomit this 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 nonsense it's appalling really really the youths of nigeria you people really need to wake up Stop voting for these ignorant people. Stop voting for these people that has no brain. Just because somebody is schooled in the UK doesn't mean the person has sense. Because if this lady had any sense, if this lady had common sense, as my mom will always say, common sense is not common. If this lady had any common sense, she won't vomit this, this... I, I'm, trying to, I'm trying to think. Of, of the perfect word I, and, and I cannot think of, of, of a word to describe what this lady just said calling the youths hoodlums and all that the same youths that you people paid to go and destroy things you the politicians including you Mojisola you and Desmond is out here vomiting bullshit and none of you were bold enough to ask the question that the whole world is watching and looking at you people and expecting you people to ask, which is who ordered the killing that night? Who ordered those soldiers to go to Lekki Gate to shoot innocent protesters? And you're out here beating around the bush talking about things that are not important? What business of ours is it if the, the, the how the... Um, youths of uh, the uk behave and moreover don't even come here with this your nonsense uh, style of the, the the youths of the uk don't behave like this don't, don't don't even bring that because we all have eyes and we all see what is happening don't even bring that you're trying to tell us that you schooled in the uk so what so what it's clear you do not have sense so you really didn't get anything from the school it was just a, a waste of your parents money Shame on you, Mojisola, Macaulay, or, or Ma, whatever your stupid name is. Shame on you. 
the fact that you're a woman is even it, it, that even made it all is even worse. I hate it when women just show complete ignorance. What are you talking about? These people are hoodlums and these are, do they have food? There are people that cannot even boast of a day's meal. And you and Desmond Elliot is out here judging people? Who do you think you are? Because all of you steal the money. You thieves, you have a say? No, you don't. You do not have a say. All of you, the politicians of Nigeria, you are all thieves. That is what you are. You will see black, you will call it white. You will see red, you will call it blue. That is what you people do. You can never stand for the truth. You all say what your godfathers want you to say. Shame on you. I feel sorry for your children. I feel sorry for your children that they, they, they cannot have a common phone because they have a mom that is crazy. They have a mom that has gone cuckoo. She has lost touch with the world. She has no clue of what she's talking about. It is a shame. It is a big shame. All right, guys, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about this complete ignorant comment from this ignorant lady. I will insert the video so you people will see what I'm talking you, about. For now, I'm I out. like your submission, Mr. Speaker, that it is not unemployment that should be the bane or the reason why youths will come out and begin to misbehave. There are unemployments in so many countries of the world, even the, in the United States. I schooled in the UK and I saw a lot of young people who were not employed, but they didn't become hoodlums. Why can't we look inwards and look for solutions to our problems? Why can't the young people look within themselves, look for their talents? Even if as graduates, what stops you from, from becoming a designer or a professional um, tiler or what have you? And make a brand of it. There is no excuse for being a hoodlump. Mr. Speaker, I think it is about time. I mentioned.